Hello everyone, uh, this is Tamer Lane providing you yet another version of uh, a guide on how to customize your hotkeys uh, inside StarCraft 2. Uh, now first of all, you will have to use a uh, standard profile uh, in your hotkey options uh, inside StarCraft uh, because otherwise if you pick, uh, for instance, uh, standard for lefties, grid, or classic, uh, that will not work with uh, Tyler's tool, sc2tools.exe. Uh, that will not work with it. It's all, it'll only changes uh, the standard options. Uh, now you will note uh, camera save uh, ad keys are different than what's provided uh, uh, by default uh, inside StarCraft 2. I'll show you how to change that as well. Um, so first of all, I'll exit StarCraft. Yeah, exit. Um, because we will not be able to change the, uh, the MPQ files if StarCraft 2 is running. Uh, now, first of all, uh, open up uh, Tyler's tool. Click Open from MPQ. Uh, that will open files directly from uh, the SC2 archives. Uh, again, make the changes that you want, then save to MPQ, and that's going to be it. Uh, just like that, in the latest uh, version of uh, SC2 tools, uh, Tyler added uh, video options, which are pretty, mo pretty much all there, and really much more options than what I will uh, know what to do with those. So. Once you're done with your changes, save to MPQ, exit, and if uh, well, that that should work uh, directly with uh, with that. Although, if you want to make uh, additional changes, uh, such as the camera save or select all warp gates uh, hotkey, uh, you will have to uh, do some manual changes. Here's how to do uh, to proceed with that. Uh, inside MPQ editor, open up uh, the directory uh, versions base 15.133, which is the latest uh, version uh, directory. Uh, open up this file. Um, make sure it's uh, the one lo with uh, the localized uh, version. Click OK. Now open up uh, the three. Uh, just like that, uh, the file that that was just modified by Tyler is uh, this one here uh, inside liberty.sc2mod uh, game hotkeys.txt. Um, now. For the additional changes, you'll have to open uh, this one here, or actually extract this one, uh, gamehotkeys.txt. We'll extract this file to some directory, which is not your default installation directory. I'm not even sure if that folder exists. Yes, it does. Great. Um, now you open up the file that we just extracted. This is what you will get inside. Um, there are a lot of uh, hotkeys that you can change uh, for pretty much all the user interface. Now the camera save options are here. Uh, I already modified those. And if you want to change the select all warp gates, you have to look for warp in. Um, now do whatever changes you want, save this file, and we'll have to replace it inside the SC2 archive. So we'll right click in this area, uh, click add files, Selects, uh, select the one we just changed and which was in keys here click open and click OK so it will ask you if you want to replace it you click yes I'm going to go with cancel um, now we're done here so we can close MPQ editor and um, actually since uh, batch 9 you can no longer uh, have this uh, these file uh, override uh, the uh, the one, or actually the ones inside the archives, uh, by simply putting them inside the uh, this folder here. So that's why we are changing the uh, the MPQ files uh, of StarCraft 2 now. Is that legal? Well, good question. Um, actually, I had a big smile uh, when I read that uh, from the uh, the Blizzard HQ visit article over ETL.net. Uh, here it says or actually this part is most important for advanced players they can even open text file and edit uh, each individual hotkey which is pretty much what we just did uh, it's not really changing the content of uh, the blizzard files we're simply um, changing some of uh, the settings if you want uh, inside these files so I'm sure if you uh, don't want to get into trouble uh, you really want to make sure that you won't get into trouble, don't change those. But again, uh, I'm really confident of not being banned uh, from Battle.net forever changing my keys. Uh, so this is pretty much it uh, for now. Uh, I, will add, I will update all the links on how to download the MPQ editor and 
uh, Tyler's tool uh, inside the uh, the original post over uh, TL.net. I'll also update uh, the uh, the article over there. Um, if you have uh, any further questions or if there are any further details that are required, I will uh, post them here uh, inside the thread. So uh, thank you for uh, watching and see you on BNet.